There was a time not that long ago when the city's outdoor basketball courts would be packed on a summer day like this. But not so much anymore, so our Anto Antoine Lewis went out and did some checking, and he found out that some players are getting more organized and moving their game indoors. Believe it or not, some say this is a dying entity, outdoor New York City basketball courts. We have to go through that transition, you know, it's been, it happened before. Even the legendary Rucker Park in Harlem, where Dr. J and countless others honed their skills, used to be standing room only all times of the day. Now there's plenty of room to stand on most days. I don't understand why it is in packed, but coming out here to an empty park, it's like, it's really not the same anymore. It don't give you the excitement to want to play. Basketball programs like this one at Chelsea Piers are gaining popularity, meaning the place to hoop it up for many now appears to be indoors. The main thing is it's good on your knees, right? We're not on the concrete jumping up and down. It's better on the wood floor. And with the weather outside in the summertime, it's very hot. You know, inside we have the fans, we have the AC going, so the kids don't overheat, which is very important for their safety. Others, like Reggie Old School Blackwell, have another theory why Cherry Tree Park on the Upper East Side has been empty lately, crime. There was a shooting back to back. You know, it's one thing to have a shooting one day, but then the very next day. Still, many say New York City's outdoor hoops appeal will bounce back, just like the basketballs that made them famous, continuing to be a place where even a boy from Virginia can brag he once hit two on a New York City outdoor basketball court. From the Upper East Side, Antoine Lewis, Fox 5 News.